creating a supplier record and this can be created through the vendor center you can look for a vendor on main menu bar or click on vendor section on the home screen on the vendor center ribbon you will find choose a new vendor then the supplier record screen will appear showing the vendor name at the top write down the vendor name in this case I am going to mention a British Telecom a telephone company and we are going to treat this as a telephone expense so after filling the details BT Group PLC the opening palace I am leaving this field as blank as of the date the company name British Telecom if you have the contact detail of the person put in the initials first name middle initials or the last name and if you know the job title put in there as well then the more main phone number if you have one please mention there and if you have got the main email address you can put in there as well in this case what I'll be doing I'll be putting that info at bt.com <coughs> then if you got all of the details like the website do mention it I'm going to mention here at www.bt.com then I'll be moving further to the address register address of that organization of that vendor in this my is British Telecom so I'll be putting down BT group PLC BT Center Eight one New Bait Street, London. In the postcode, I'll be mentioning EC one A seven A J. and definitely the country going to be United Kingdom once I'm done with the information provided I need to choose OK to save that information and you can see in the address details if you done with this section after completing the address information move on to the payment setting bar you have the account number of that supplier you can mention there if the supplier has given you any sort of credit limit type in the credit limit payment terms I'm mentioning net 30 days and print name on the checks as VT tax setting if the supplier has some sort of tax ID please mention there addition account setting what sort of account it is is a telephone expense so I'm mentioning the telephone expense once I mentioned telephone it has given me the account head and the nominal code which is 68100 moving further what type of vendor it is I'll be mentioning a service provider once done you can if the information you have entered is correct and you wish to save the account create click OK at the bottom if you do not wish to save the information <clears throat> you can discard now you we have all the information what we entered earlier about that supplier you can browse through it and you will have a proper understanding how to set up a new supplier in QuickBooks you can create as many suppliers of your business as you like to accordingly through the same process what I have described here thank you very much